Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I am in my car in front of the South Haven Library. I just dropped Skylar off at therapy and I want to make a puzzle again. I enjoyed that last week. And it's raining. We are supposed to have a storm right where I am, not so much in Hernando. And it was so windy on the highway that it was exciting and scary at the same time because I thought maybe a tornado was coming because it was very windy and leaves were all spinning around. But like I said, also a little bit exciting. So I'm going to go into the library while it is not pouring down. And uh, if I get caught in the rain on the way out, well, I don't care as much because... I'm just going to be going home after that, so I can be soaking wet. Let's go in. I'm going to pick, you know, hopefully another 100-piece puzzle. I'll show it to you. I'll show you when it's finished, if I can finish it. And uh, that's it. I'm sad. I didn't realize that there's not a whole lot of puzzles, and I just assumed they'd all be like 100, maybe 200 or 300 pieces. Most of them are a 1,000. I could only find one other puzzle with 100 pieces, other than a couple of like the kind that you get like a Dollar Tree, or they're flimsy and the pieces don't uh, connect well. Anyway, this is what I have. Dinosaurs. But it's a puzzle. But I won't be able to make anything next week. I could start a puzzle. You can start it and just leave it out, but I don't know. This edge seemed to take me forever. I'm sad. I don't have time to finish it. I got here a little later than I wanted, and uh, Skylar gets out about 10 minutes before the hour. So that's why she was coming out when I got there last time and I don't want her to have to wait so I'm gonna put this away and uh, I'll talk to you in the car I'm waiting for Skylar now she should be out in just a little bit yeah sad that I didn't finish the puzzle I just wasn't enjoying it because it had some broken pieces and then it had one piece that there was a piece completely ripped off <laughs> and that made me sad and it was kind of like darkish wasn't a fun puzzle to make and I really didn't have time and then that started making me nervous a light just came on so I put it away I didn't ask if I you know should leave it out because in Hernando people will start really big puzzles and just leave them out and we can sit at the table and put some pieces together um, I might I don't know I might go do that start a puzzle there if I had my third bedroom that I would have loved to have that would have been my like puzzle room because I love making puzzles and I would have had like a cozy chair with a TV where I could crochet and just leave that stuff out all the time and you know but I don't have that and I don't feel like doing that to my living room I don't know why I have this thing where I want my my little living space to be completely empty <laughs> I don't want to walk into my apartment and see things. I know my work rooms are the bedrooms, and I'm okay with that, with, you know, having a lot of stuff in there, but I don't know. So I watch a woman named Karen. Her name is Karen Puzzles on YouTube. I don't know what it is on TikTok. I found her through TikTok, and if you like to see people make puzzles... She uh, made one. I'm watching that series right now. It's about a year old. She made a 24,000 piece puzzle in four parts, and uh, but it's a six part series. And she, you know, talks about the history of puzzles. She likes to get vintage puzzles on eBay, and she gets puzzle companies sell, uh, sending her puzzles all the time. So, I don't know. If you want to go check her out, it's Karen Puzzles on YouTube. She doesn't know me at all. I don't know her other than I watch her make puzzles. But if you like to watch puzzle making, then you'll like to watch her. And Skylar should be out any minute. And I don't know. I'm going to go home and just work, as always, and try to stay awake. 
past 8 p.m. <laughs> lately. I think it's because it gets dark early, so my body starts saying, hey, it's time to uh, go to bed there pretty soon because it's been dark for a while, and it's really going to hit me when it gets dark, you know, when we change the time. Now, I'm not against dark. I used to say I wish it could start to get dark at noon <laughs> in Maine for some reason. I liked the darkness, and... You know, I don't know. I don't know if it's because I did a lot of swimming and I was in the sunshine a lot. Maybe my my body and brain just liked that, not being in a dungeon. So um, I'll get used to the dark again. Tomorrow, there's a painting class here in where? Yeah, at the library that I was just at. The But it's 6 to 7 p.m., and I think I'll be pooped out. I had asked Skylar if she would go once with me. And she said, sure. Now, I knew she wasn't excited about it. But I would have liked to have gone. And uh, I could go alone if she doesn't want to. I'm certainly not going to force her to go to a class. But the thing is, is 6 to 7. I'm not going to feel like driving. <laughs> I'm going to be tired. So I don't know. Uh, I would have liked to have gone to their classes during the summer when it would have still been light out, but I didn't uh, pay much attention. So I don't know what else to talk about. I'm just uh, uh, bored right now, waiting. I got here maybe a little too early. Last time she was coming out, and I, I just don't want to make her wait for me. Derek texted um, and asked if we hit, got hit with heavy winds on the way here. I was like, yes, I thought it was going to be a tornado. And I don't know what I would do with a tornado. I don't, I don't know, like, where to go. <laughs> it seems to me like a lot of people are not that afraid of them because you'll see people on TikTok all the time just outside of their house watching a tornado come closer and closer. And I'm like, don't you want to go somewhere else? Uh, so, oh, here she comes. So that's it. I will uh, talk to you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.